The components which face the thermonuclear plasma are one of the most demanding components of the heater machine. They have to receive a very intensive heat flux, which is a thousand times the heat flux in summer at midday here. So here you can see uh, one prototype of the so-called blanket modules. There are uh, 440 of them to cover the plasma facing surfaces and each of these modules uh, weight about uh, 4 tons which means uh, about uh, 2 big cars. Here you can see uh, slits. These uh, slits are there in order to reduce uh, the electromagnetic loads whereas uh, the various holes that you can see here are uh, aimed at uh, uh, providing to lift the component you know, during the assembly and the disassembly of the machine and also for the uh, hydraulic connection of the first wall panel which is uh, the component that is located on top of this one and uh, protect uh, this uh, huge part from the radiation coming from uh, the plasma. Now if you look at the back side of the so-called blanket shield modules these four big holes uh, are there to ensure that the component stays in place in spite of the very high electromagnetic loads these four small holes are there to ensure that the component is kept against the vacuum vessel. And here there is a, a, a large opening. This hole is to, uh, to connect the module with the cooling circuit of the machine. The heater plasma phasing components requires very high technologies in order to cope with the high heat flux and radiation coming from the plasma. In this respect we needed the effort of six out of the seven heater parties to develop the technologies which are suitable to manufacture these very important components for the machine performance and machine operation.